Hello and welcome to episode 59 of series 2 of Become a Legend Story Mode. So let's talk about the last episode. It definitely set a record for the least commented on. And, uh, well, it didn't have any views either. Video in the history of this channel, I would say. At least proportionate to how big the channel is now. And, uh, yeah, I get it. Things aren't that exciting. But wait, wait, wait. What's that? The second game today? Yes, we're back into the Champions League. This is where we get serious. We're still third in the league, but it might be difficult to uh, really push for the top spot. But what we can do is win a cup. We're still in the FA Cup. We're still in the Champions League. Still a lot to play for. So let's put in a good home performance against Bournemouth, first of all. And then go and smash Roma in the second game of this episode. It's Gabby Guerra starting again today. Gabby's looking on great form at the moment. That's one thing to be uh, happy about. Interesting lineup today. Mendy in a, a defensive midfield. That's a first. We've not seen that in this formation. He doesn't really get much in the way of game time. Mane in today. Good to see Oxley Chamberlain not starting today for a change. And then Sterling on the left. It's different. We haven't seen this sort of formation very often. Rudiger in there as well, which is good to see. And Gabi Aguero. Aguero on a blue today. Let's see if we can set him up again against a uh, yeah quite weak looking centre back trio. Chris Baird. Danielli the highest at 74 rated and then Simpson 62 rated. We should have some joy here. Tom Davis is up to 80 rated for Bournemouth. That's He's, he's doing well. That's an interesting midfield actually. Davis and Maitland-Niles in there. There's a lot of promise, a lot of future promise. Maybe not so now. Let's see if we can uh, put them to the sword at the Etihad. Start this episode off on a strong note. So as we know, we're waiting really for Manchester United to mess up. That's the only thing that's going to prevent them winning the league this season. Obviously, we need to beat them. When the reverse fixture of our battering at the beginning of the season at Old Trafford comes about. Hopefully we can do better at the Etihad. But for now, we just need to keep it three points every game. Let's just get some rhythm going in the league. That's what we've struggled for. Defensive howlers have made that the case. But it looks a little more solid recently. Mane into Gabby. Easy 1-2 there. And now Mane looks early for Sergio Aguero. Surely. Oh, how has he not got to that? Oh, lovely work here. And now Wilson through on goal. One-on-one -on -one with Edison. Edison forced into a save. Oh, we were ripped apart there. Manchester City-esque passing through the centre. One touch. Two touch. Little flick over the top from Maitland-Niles into Wilson. Got the wrong side of John Stones. Edison forced into a big save. To spare our blushes early on here, but they will have a corner. Gabby. Good defensive header away. Can Aguero get to this? No, he can't. And they'll have another go here. Wilson will have an effort on goal again. Edison forced into a save. Find Sadio Mane. Back to Gabby. His turn was slow. Is it nicked off him? And now Euston into the box. No! Great effort. Lovely save from Edison. Wilson stooping header. Oh, God. We are struggling here. Really struggling. Oh, Mane wins it. Now Aguero into Gabby. We can time the pass here. Surely it's 1-0. Sergio Aguero one-on-one. -on -one. He doesn't miss from there. Left-footed finish. And Bournemouth's great work. Quickly undone by a big error in the middle. Mane won it back from a very errant pass. And the defender just did not track Sergio Aguero. Gabby could put through probably the easiest assist he'll ever have. And uh, we're off the mark here. Bournemouth looking very good to begin with. And it's the simplest, simplest of goals to undo it all. Gabby picks that one up. The loose ball. Now Aguero. Gabby wants it into the box. Torre's ball wasn't a great one. Sterling back in. That's a much better ball. Gabby have his feet. What a block that was. David Silver over this one. Gabby's made the run across the box. Gets up for the header. Oh, it's saved on the line. And Davis can clear. We keep getting to these corners. More often than not, though. Force a great save from the keeper, as we did that time. Gabby into Mane. Wants it back now into the box. Away from Daniele. Low ball in looking for Aguero. Aguero again with the cheeky back heel. Just to chop it in. Save there again. We're pushing for this second goal. Oh, Mane skips away from his man. Now Gabby. Given time to look up. Can push it out wide to Yaya Toure. He's made a good run down the right wing. Ball in looking for Aguero. The header wide. <sighs> Have we not scored another yet? And half-time here at the Etihad. This has been a pretty dull game, to be honest. We've had six shots on target. We've really been peppering Bournemouth's goal. They started strongly, to be fair. It could be a very different score had they taken their chances early on. But we should have been two or three up. 
by the break. Hopefully we can finish this one off early in the second half and have a nice rest for the game against Roma. Great passing here from Bournemouth, as we saw at the beginning of the first half. Yaya Torre gets a foot in on Lombardi, but they keep it moving. Oh, Houston sold Mane down the river with that one. Can he get a ball into the box? He can. Wilson with the header. Oh, side netting. Bournemouth looking dangerous. Jabby now picks it up on the halfway line. Finds the ball out to Mendy. Oh, that's an awful pass. And then that's an awful pass as well from Tom Davis. Gabby steps inside. Just to get the shot away. It's blocked. Simpson will be able to cover and clear. Oh, but that's an awful pass. And again, Gabby now. They're on goal. Can he find Aguero? No, he can't. Oh, that's, that's poor. That's poor. We know we need to pass more. We don't do it enough in situations like that. But Aguero just wouldn't quite make the right run. Loads of space for Pew here. Cuts back in. Pereira at the far post will jump for it. Back to Ainsley Maitland-Niles into Lombardi. Tom Davis, edge of the box, will have a go. Great hit from the ex-Everton man. Forced to save from Edison. Bournemouth still well in this one. Pew ball into the box. Sperrett with a bit of space. Edge of the box. Just wide. Bournemouth with more chances to draw this level. We cannot allow it. Oh, Gabby intercepts. 82 minutes gone. Manchester City definitely winding down in this one. Really not putting much effort into attacking. Gabby's put a good ball into Sergio Aguero. He's not going to get there. <sighs> Could do with that second because Bournemouth really pushing us here. And there we are. Wow, what an uninspiring game of football that was. If I was in the Manchester City crowd now, I would probably be booing, even though we won. We were poor, really poor. The goal was one of the worst goals that we've scored. Not the worst. I mean, you've got to put those chances away. You've got to create them. It's fine. We pounced on one mistake. I guess we did have more chances in the end, but it was pretty even. We made far less passes as well than Bournemouth. Not exciting. Another man of the match somehow for Gabby. I don't know who he's been paying to get all these man of the matches, but it's fine. But still, not the uh, not the build up to Roma we wanted. But it is three points. Got to remember that. And nine points now behind United. Still only one loss for them this season. They just don't look like they can be stopped. That is the issue at the moment. But Gabby's development also cannot be stopped. Look at that 86 rated, only 24 years old. He's going to be one of the world's very best. He already is. Imagine what it'd be like when he hits his prime. 26. I guess that's probably about prime for a striker like him. But anyway, three days later now, and we have the first leg of the knockouts. The, is it quarterfinal? Are we in quarterfinal? Round of 32? I'm not sure. But it's a massive, massive game against Italian Giants Roma. And we start off away from home. Okay, so let's take a look at the teams. This is absolutely huge. I'm starting to feel a bit of nerves now for the first time in a long time. And who do you start when you need a result in the Champions League? Probably your best chance of winning something. An incredibly sought after and glittering prize. Yep, you bring in Theo Walcott for the first time this season. What the hell are you doing, Pep? I mean, sure, he's on a blue. He really does go with form, doesn't he? If you do well in training for Guardiola at the moment, you will play. No doubt about it. It's a shame to see Mane miss out. He's been excellent. Hmm, not sure I would have chosen that midfield, but it's okay. Gondon and Silva. They're normally pretty decent. And Aguero's on a blue arrow. And that's good. Gabby's form not great as usual. Up against a Roma side with... No, mm, they're lacking a bit at the back, actually. A 74-rated centre-back. You would expect better from Roma. Still got nine Golan in the centre. Schick up front. Dzeko's on the bench. No place for Emerson. Hmm. I mean, what we really want today is an away goal. That would be an excellent start. Let's get into it. So I guess the reason that we stayed at Manchester City, one of the big ones, is that we're still fighting on three different fronts. The Champions League probably being the most realistic and the most exciting of those battles at the moment. And you can't really lose a two-legged tie away from home. But my word, can you put yourself in a great position to win it? A goal or two today would make us, uh, yeah, make us the hot favourites for this one. But don't score and allow Roma to come to the Etihad with the chance of grabbing an away goal. And then you're in a bit of trouble. So, Gabby, if you're going to find your shooting boots, which haven't been red hot recently, then now's the time to find them. I mean, we have actually been in good form, winning form at least, maybe not goal-scoring form. What can we pull out of the bag today in Italy? Let's go. Silva into Aguero. Can he hold it up? He's got no other options, really. Spreads it wide to Leroy Sané. Roma defending in numbers already here. 
They don't want to give away a goal, but Gabby gets it into the box, steps inside, looks to poke it in. Juan Jesus does well to block the cross, but we will have a deep throw in here. Gabby looking for space, edge of the box. Come on, David. Falls to Gabby, has a go. Didn't really wrap his foot around that very well. David Silva's pass, uncharacteristically, made it very difficult for him. Just in front of him would have been better. It was behind. The block came in and we'll have a corner. Gabby lurking, fast stick. Looking to lose his man, and he has done. Damian, though, will jump. Oof. And they'll get it away here. Great work, Fernandinho. And now Theo Walcott back to Gundogan. Sane into Aguero. One more ball into Gabby. Could do it. Couldn't quite find a way through. Oh, that's really poor. Gabby can go for the lob here. Off the bar. No. Oh, I probably could have just finished that normally. Oh, saw the keeper off his line. It had all broken down. Some awful Roma defending. Gabby got the ball back. And he saw the Hollywood finish. Went for the chip just off the bar. Would have been an incredible start here away from home to get the first goal. Gabby comes to collect. Finds David Silva. Now Aguero loses it out, but it has fallen to Gabby. It's a step back inside. Strength here from Gabby goal. Can slip in David Silva. Now the shot is off, but it's well wide. Just imagine you're passing it into the back of the net, David. You can do that. Great work from Gabby. Great strength to hold off the bigger man here. And then calm play just to swivel. Put it into the Spaniard. He puts it well wide. We're, we're working some opportunities, though. This is a promising start here. We've had a little bit more possession in this first 24 minutes. Can we make it count? Fernandinho, well won back, but Nyan Golan gets to it. Damian now into Under, seeing a lot of the ball. Nyan Golan now into Schick. He's off to Pellegrini. Great ball into El Sharawi. Into the box, steps away from Otamendi. Danger here, great footwork. But they'll play it simply round. Oh my god, and Otamendi has to pull off an acrobatic bicycle kick to get that one out. That was close. The woodwork now keeping out both sides. This has been an intense and exciting first half so far. And Roma continue to come forward. Matteo Damian, the ex-Man United player. Back to nine. Golan, another great save from Edison. And we're saved. <laughs> David Silva, great work. Wins it back. Gabby looks to go for the 1-2 with uh, Aguero. Can push it now to Leroy Sané. Will make his way into the box. He's got Aguero and Gabby to look for. Goes for Aguero. And his shot cannons off the defender. Chances galore here. This has been a pulsating first 45 minutes. Or nearly 45 minutes. Either side easily could have scored there. It was a good ball to release Sané. Good block. We do have a corner. Gabby again. Looks to get away from his man. And he has done. He's got, oh, just misjudged the flight of it. El Shirawi. Early ball into Schick. Gonlons, El Sharawi again. And Florenzi, they're passing it around simply, but it's working. Good ball in. Stones does enough. It's fallen to shit, though. His effort. Oh, no. No, no, no. That's cruel. That is very cruel. Came off the Manchester City defender. It was a big deflection for Schlick. Oh, let's take another look at that. That is heartbreak here. It's been a great half. There's no doubt about it. Good football from both sides. This came in. It was a good ball. John Stones' is header. Not convincing, and it came off the knee of Otamendi over the top of Edison, who's had to make two great saves already, but there was nothing he could do about that one. John Stones, could he have done more just to get that away? Possibly. It was fortunate, maybe, that it fell to Schlick, but there was no way that was going in if it wasn't for the knee of Nicolas Otamendi, and we're behind here. Guero. Gabby wants it chipped into his path. Oh, he's battling with Gonlons. He's forced him to put out for a corner. It's our third corner here. Can Gabby get his head to this one? Hasn't managed it with the first two. Again, he's looking to skip away from his defender. He's going to rise here with Fazio. Fazio well above him. And shit can bring it away. Ah. And that's it. First half over here in Rome. And it was uh, a gut-wrenching way to give up uh, what was a well-fought 0-0. But yeah, it was the deflection from Otamendi that turned it into a 1-0 to the home side. And as you can see, it's been very equal. We've had a little less possession than them, but the amount of shots, we've had more than them. I think we can do something in this second half. Could have easily gone either way, but again, an away goal still definitely what we need to get. Even if it ends up one all, that's absolutely fine. Silver. Out to Leroy Sané. Oh, that's an incredible ball through to Gabby. Ah! <laughs> Couldn't get it out of his feet. Great defending. Oh, but that's awful. And now Gabby. 
Oh, too much again. Two great opportunities squandered. Oh, Gabby, Gabby, Gabby. Needed to be more decisive there. And then straight away, Roma down the other end of the pitch. El Sharawi steps back inside. Will he put a ball into the box? It's blocked by Leroy Sané. Gabby was ball watching there, though. Couldn't get to that. Oh, but he's intercepted here. And now, can we launch a break? Gabby all alone. But he spots the run. Oh, David Silva didn't have enough on it. Walcott gets it away. And now Gabby can release Leroy Sané. He's in loads of space here. He's got Aguero and Gabby inside of him. Oh, it's a great ball for Aguero. The header, though. The wrong choice. He could have squared it. I don't know if he could have taken a touch. We're, we're knocking on the door here. And Walcott is off now. Oxley chamberlain replaces him. It was an odd decision to start him in the first place. Oh my god, how have you allowed that? No, defensive mix-up, shit through on goal. You've got to be kidding me. <sighs> they make up the ground. Sergio Aguero now, wide. Leroy Sané, will he put a ball in? No, Aguero will. It's not the best one, but we'll get to it. Inside to Gondoan. His left foot effort, wide. Oh, come on, City. We can do this. Perotti now steps back in. Holds it up well. Great footwork. Oh, gets away from Fernandinho, but that's a great challenge from Oxlade-Chamberlain. And now, what can we work? Gabby looking to run away from Aguero, and then chips it over the top. Into the Argentinian. Oh, Gonlons does enough. Just enough. We keep trying, we keep pushing. Something's got to happen soon. Oh, Sane, great interception. And then expansive stuff to find his man. Gabby now into Fernandinho. Lovely one, two. Into Aguero now. Back to Sane. Ball in, looking for Gabby. Oh, Fazio rises. Still not cleared. Ball to the far post. Oxley Chamberlain won't get to it. Ten minutes left here. We're really, really trying. Just doesn't seem to be working. And that's it here for Gabby. 84 minutes gone. And both Aguero and Gabby goal off. Lacazette comes on. And Gabriel Jesus, I imagine. Yep, he's on as well. Can they find something in this last five minutes? We've been pushing and pushing. But Roma have defended solidly since going a goal up. As you'd expect. That's all they needed to do. It was a lucky first goal. And then they've just shut up shot completely. And it's worked. It's worked very, very well. Well, we'll see if anything happens. Hard to imagine it will. Oof, and there it is. Full time here in Rome. Gutted. Absolutely gutted. We tried and tried in that second half. We really did. And it was an awful goal to go behind to. We didn't really get enough shots on target, but we had a lot of shots. Roma just, they, they shut up. They shut up shop in that second half. Part the bus. That's all they needed to do. And they did it very, very well. You've got to question the uh, selection of Theo Walcott, but other than that, a very disappointing day at the office. But still another leg to go. And there's no reason that we can't win at home at the Etihad. We've just got to prevent them scoring. It would have been great to get that away goal. That was the uh, that was the target. We didn't get it. But the uh, tie very much still alive. Only a goal down. We can do it. We had the chances. Gabby hit the bar so early on. That was a real kick in the teeth. Maybe could have been a bit more composed. Maybe could have just gone for a normal shot. But when those chances open up, you'd be an enemy of football not to try them. So there we have it. Join me in the next episode. We've got West Ham away and Sunderland away in the league. More excitement there. Let's just remind ourselves. Oh, I know. Oh actually, I know. We're about nine points behind Manchester United in the league. We just need to claw them back. We can't really afford to lose either of those games. We need six points there and just hope Manchester United just at least drop a point or two. Just along the way until we meet them again. Hopefully. We pray. We can hope and pray. And we can hope and pray for the, uh, for the next leg against Roma. We need a win there, or this season is dead in the water. See you in a bit.